How's everybody doing today? Hopefully everybody's off to a great productive day. On today's video, we'll be doing an unboxing and a seasoning of the Master Bill Propane Smoker. All right, so I'd like to welcome everybody to the channel. If you're new to the channel and you like the content, consider subscribing to the channel and clicking that notification bell so you don't miss none of my future videos. So what we have here is the Master Built Propane Smoker. And this right here was a gift from my son for Christmas. So I wanna break it in for New Year's. So I have to um, get it seasoned up today. That way I can use it tomorrow to smoke some um, food on it. So what we got here is the Master Built uh, cover protective um, cover and like I said the master built propane um, smoker master built um, makes a electric one and I believe they make uh, a regular standard one they should use like um, charcoal and stuff but let's go ahead and get this thing opened up and see what we got here All right, y'all, so as I'm opening the box to take the parts out to get it set up, look at all my screws. All my screws are just on the ground in there. So come on, Master Bill. You gotta make sure your workers are doing a good job or doing what they're supposed to do. And as I look at this, look, everything is opened up. So I don't know if it got bust open during the um, shipping or is this one returned? Cause it is scratched up. I don't know, but not too happy with that for this to be a brand new item. All right, y'all. So it's about an hour, 15 to an hour and a half into putting this thing together. I have to honestly say these are the worst instructions I have ever seen to me. And my reason saying that is all the parts in the book are labeled 21. That's part 17, part 19. But when you go to get the parts, absolutely none of them have numbers on it. They all either wrapped in plastic like this right here in styrofoam, but nothing has what part numbers what. So you have to figure out what part goes where, even with the legs. Um, it shows the legs right here, but it doesn't tell you what leg is what leg. You have to um, pretty much figure it out. And then after I put them on wrong twice, you can tell by the little piece right here on both ends that those are the pieces right here. But it would have been nice if they had it labeled, you know, would have saved me some time. But I've seen a couple of videos where people said they put this thing together in 30 minutes. I don't believe that. All right, y'all. So I finally, finally got this thing assembled. And it only took me two hours. So we're going to close it up so y'all can see what it looked like. Bear with me trying to do this with one hand. All right, so here it is. The Master Built Propane Smoker. Um, if I um, was able to talk with somebody from Master Built, I would tell them they definitely need to work on their um, instructions, make them a little more user friendly, should I say. But, uh, Got everything put together. Got all the trays in, got all the racks in there. So what I'm about to do now is clean it out. And once I get the whole entire thing cleaned out, then I'm gonna do what's called seasoning it. And um, it's almost like um, for those who have um, cast iron and you season your cast iron pot, that's the same thing with this right here. So before you utilize it for the first time, they want you to um, go ahead and season it. So what I'm gonna do is clean the whole entire thing out, wash the racks off and everything, wipe down the uh, window, pretty much the whole entire inside. And then I'm gonna come back and I cook some bacon early. I'm gonna take some bacon grease and a little bit of oil and I'm gonna go and 
season the entire inside of it, every single thing in the inside. And then um, we're gonna go ahead and throw some um, wood chunks in there and go ahead and run it for four hours and then it'll be seasoned. And then if it doesn't rain tomorrow, I will be putting some uh, chicken and doing some salmon jerky in there. So let me go ahead and get this thing cleaned out and then I'll um, cut you back on when I show you how, I, um, how I'm gonna season it. All right, y'all, so now that I got it all wiped out, I'll show you what I got here. Got a little 97 cent uh, grill brush. Got some um, grill nonstick spray. Then I have some vegetable oil, and then I have some bacon grease from earlier. So what I'm gonna do is, I'm gonna pour some of this oil into the bacon grease, mix it up a little bit. I'm gonna pull the racks out. I'm gonna spray the racks down, and then I'm gonna take the brush, dip it in the um, grease, and wipe the whole inside of the um, metal down. So I do the entire inside of it. All right, y'all, so I got the whole thing coated with the um, bacon grease and the cooking oil. Now I'm gonna go ahead and take this Grill Master Crisco spray and I'm gonna go ahead and spray the racks down. All right, so I finished getting the rack sprayed down. Got the whole inside season with the bacon grease and regular um, Crisco. I added my wood chips. All I have right now is some uh, wood chunks, cherry. They said, um, make sure you get it up to 350 so it can burn all the chemicals and stuff that um, come on it from the factory. They said, don't put no water in the water tray. So let's go ahead and get this closed up. Got some big wood chunks in there, but we're going to let it do what it do so it can get seasoned. And then we're going to go ahead and get this thing lit up. And we're going to see what it's going to do. We're going to see how long it's going to take to smoke. I'm going to um, put it on time lapse in. We're going to see how long it's going to take for it to start smoking. All right, y'all. So I went ahead and got it um, ignited. Cut it on. Got it up to 300. Let's see how long it's going to take. All right, y'all, so there we have it. Three minutes in, and it's starting to smoke. I'm gonna come around the back side so y'all can get a better look. So as y'all can see, within three minutes, the smoker is starting to smoke. So we're gonna go ahead and uh, let it go for about three to four hours. So make sure we get all the chemicals and stuff out like the uh, manufacturer recommend. Um, hopefully y'all find this video helpful if y'all interested in looking for a, a smoker like I said this is a master built propane smoker I'm not affiliated with them at all this is um, my first smoker that I um, ever had if I can talk to somebody from master built I would tell them they need to make the instructions a little more user friendly if they're gonna have the parts labeled in the book it would be nice if they had the actual parts labeled so you know what was what but once again thank y'all for watching hopefully everybody's gonna have a, a great day great evening a happy new year and we'll catch you on the next one